Mm-mm-mm-mm. Smash that like button now. Smash that like button. Uh, Asalaamu As Alaikum. Shalawam. <clears throat> Hotel. Uh, power to my people that is scattered all over the four corners of this planet. And this is your boy, man, coming to you once again. I always bring you that heat off the mound all the time. All the time, man. Unfortunately, uh, this is when they tried to put it under the, under the rug with the rest of the roaches and rodents of this hemisphere. Mm. A Florida police chief condemned an officer's chokehold on a black man. Her department permitted it. Mm. Mm -mm. This is Yahoo News, too. Uh, Sarah Soda, Florida. In a memo copied by Sarasota Police Chief Bernadette DiPino, on May 19th, a captain concluded that when an officer placed a knee on the neck of a suspect during an arrest in a day earlier, the application of force appears reasonable. The conclusion by Captain Dimitri uh, Constitupolosov I can't, I'm fucking up his last name. <laughs> Goodness. Came into a use of force to report Officer Matthews Hughes. And to DePinos, according to this document, recounting actions by Officer Drazuno Mer Mer uh, Martinez, as he struggled with the 27 year old Patrick Corral, a black Saratos Sarasota resident, while there's Arresting him on alleged domestic battery charge on May the 18th. <laughs> okay, so you arrest this man on May the 18th for a battery charge. Okay, let's see how this went down. The arrest, Martinez kneeling on Carol's neck, did not become public until June the 1st. Oh, so he was on your boy neck, too. And they didn't want to release it to you. See what I mean? The cover-up is worse than the crime. Like I said, when the video was encountered, post post to social media. Yeah, they don't want none of that heat. The police department did not reference the use of force report, but issued a statement then saying the agency had been tagged in the video post and that the Pino was disturbed to see an officer kneeing on the head and the neck of an individual in the video. Now, see, I wonder if all this shit wouldn't have happened to George, uh, George Floyd. Uh, wouldn't this be magnified? I don't think so. While it appears an officer eventually moves his leg to the individual's back, this tactic is not taught, used by advocate by our agency. That's what the uh, commander says. The department said uh, DePino had placed the officer who was identified earlier this week by the agency on administrative leave. Man, it seems like if brothers do that shit, man, we'd be fucked off. I'm going to get no second chances. The department said the Pino had placed, yeah, like I said, on Mr. Lee on June the 2nd, two weeks after the use of force report, said the review had been, mm, closed following to, uh, the conclusion that he was, uh, that the force was reasonable. They're trying to say the force was reasonable. The document shows Officer Hughes sent a message to Sergeant Daniel Weinsberg stating, I have concerns regarding the officer putting his knee in the back of the subject neck to maintain control for your review. Weinsberg responded that the use of force is currently under investigation by Eternal Affairs. I mean, to have a motherfucking knee on your neck, man, a knee can fuck up some shit. It's a lot of pressure, like your feet, you know. You can't apply much pressure you can with your hands or you can't your feet. Your feet are just naturally more stronger. Attempts to reach DePino for comments on Friday were unsuccessful. Uh, 
Two days before Carroll's arrest became public, the penal had condemned the tactics of police using the knee to a suspect neck to subdue them. In response to a viral video that showed the death of George Floyd and black man who died May the 25th at the Minneapolis police man, Derek Chauvin kneed on his knee, excuse me, kneed on his neck for nine minutes, leaving him unable to breathe. Mm. Wow. Mm -mm -mm. It's just sad, man. I should recounter this shit again. <laughs> And the cover up, cover up some motherfuckers. But I'm gonna leave a link in the description box and um, like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. You'll be notified every time I drop any type of content. And it's just wow. The cover up is real, y'all. The cover up is real. They didn't want Florida to blow up now, but I don't know. This may. Oh, I don't know. It's just a lot going on in my city, too. It's a lot going on. It's a lot going on everywhere. And a motherfucker is just blew away by it. You feel me? But like the video, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. You'll be notified every time I drop any type of content. Peace.